Have you ever felt the need to relieve some stress? Well, we can make that happen down at the Vanilla Unicorn Gentlemen's Club. You can come down and see some chicks popping some pussy on a handstand for $7, or you can get some $2 drinks and get white boy wasted. Come on down to the Vanilla Unicorn, or I will kill everybody, including your mother. Bye now. Yo, what's going on, everybody? I'm just bull crabbing. Uh... <laughs> I'm about to go do the big heist real quick. Uh, I think we have to plan it out. Not totally sure, but uh, I just went into walking mode. I can't run no more. So, let's see. Niggas always talking shit. But, um. Somebody get me a sandwich. Yo, you still in here? Damn. Where you getting that, that nice treatment? But uh, you guys might see that I changed my clothes for Trevor and his hairstyle. He got the clean cut, so does Michael, so does uh Franklin. So, you know, we going into this job, you know, heads hell high, with a nice little respect. We're trying to get this mugger. Look at Lester Punk ass. So, uh, this is it. Arr. Hope you and Michael will be able to uh, let each other move on in peace. I just hope he keeps his fucking mouth shut, you know? I mean, when the heat comes. And we both know we pull this off, it's going to come. Yes, it will come, and I think that he will. And Franklin? And Franklin what? You going to keep your mouth shut? Why? Because I've squealed like a bitch so far? Hey, you ain't seen nothing yet. <laughs> you know, bit of heat. A few years back there in the Midwest, and your boy Michael, he changed his name. Well, the way he tell it, it wasn't that clear. Hey, sorry I'm late. Oh, we were just talking about you. Well, don't worry. Another few hours, you never have to talk about me again, Trevor. You're the one who likes to talk. Watch your back. You too. That's all I'm saying. Fuck you. Fuck you! All right, excuse all right, all me, right, enough, huh? Enough! You're... Enough! Thank you. <clears throat> okay, uh, this is it. Well, we have two options. They're both a little, uh, out there. But then again, what do you expect? Okay, option one. We hijack their armored cars. We take the crews hostage, and then we infiltrate the depository. Now, once you're in there and you've got the score, we send in a team of modded cars. You load up, you get out. And we'll need to infiltrate the transportation grid and manipulate it to aid our escape. But option two, we cause a distraction out front, make them think we're dumb. <laughs> well, we've never had a problem convincing people of that, have we? <laughs> the other guys will be drilling, taking what they can, you're going to be the distraction. Always the attention seeker. You know, for a guy who's always stepping on his friends to get ahead, he has an unfortunately low sense of self-worth. Okay, okay, let me show you the board. To uh, recap, these are our options. We try to make them give us the gold, or we drill a big old hole in the side of the bank and we take it out. If you're drilling a big old hole, you'll need a big old drill, a tunnel bore machine. I'll locate it, but you have to steal it and store it near the bank. They're excavating a new part of the metro network around there, so that's where you'll go in. Uh, we'll need choppers for the getaway, too. Uh, Trevor has one we can use, the other can be bought. The guys on the ground will need a getaway car, so get something fast and tough, and then modify it as much as you can to increase your chances of getting away from the cops. It's got to be stored in a parking garage near the UD. Uh, there's going to be a lot of heat, so think about that. Um, per, I'm forgetting something. Uh, oh, that's it. <laughs> we'll need a train to land the gold on and take it to the warehouse. You'll have to steal it. Uh, again, I'll send you the details. Now, if you're interested in the more um, subtle approach, hijacking the armored cars and so on, huh, you've got to get some police stingers. Only cops are licensed to have them, so that's a headache of its own. Uh, what else? Um, oh, right. Uh, you'll need to get a hold of and mod some getaway cars. Uh, normal suspension's gonna give out under a couple of tons of gold. Whoa, man, a couple of tons? Four tons in total. <laughs> and that's what I can get the system to divert into the cage we're hitting. Fuck me! Okay, okay, last thing. You remember that underpass we saw from the helicopter? Well, that's where I'll set up the uh, smoke and mirrors to get the cops off your scent. I've heard that before. Michael, subtle or obvious, what's it going to be? All right. Well, um, I think I might go with the subtle approach, seeing as though I hate flying and I do not want to try to land a, a pallet of gold on a moving train or a, a standard standing alone train at that. Like, I just hate flying, period. So 
It looked like this. Uh, you want me to flip a coin? No, you're not gonna flip a fucking coin. I'm trying to trying to realize what's about to go down. I do like getting the getaway cars since that's pretty dope. Mining the cars. Plus, I own Los Santos with Franklin, so mining will be free. I won't have to pay for that. Um, they said that. Trevor has a helicopter, but we're going to have to pay for another one. I don't want to do that. Plus, I don't want to have to steal a drill and steal a train. Like, that's too much work. I could just get some nice cars and do what it do. So, uh, I think I'll go for the more subtle approach. The suspense is... Shut the fuck up. Alright. Oh, you want him to give you the medal? Okay, well, it's going to take a big crew. Uh, two gunmen, two drivers, and a hacker. First gunman comes into the bank with you. It helps you move the gold into the reinforced hot rods. Second gunman is there to take down the armored cars and bring the hostages to a safe house. All right, so. All right, we might have to go with Chef and uh, Gustavo. Yeah, so. He's gonna be the first gunman. He's a pro. Not much else to say. And then we're gonna have to go with Chef. And driver number one takes the wheel in the fourth getaway car. Is gonna be at the bank with you and help loading. They're a key part of this. Driver number two helps you hijack the armored cars and will be in charge of replacing the tires your stingers ripped out. All right. Now, the hacker, uh, they're going to break into the traffic system, buy you some time coming out of the bank, if you need it, but we might be cool. Alright, um, I think I'm going to have to go with this one. But uh, he's saying that we need a bigger crew, so the, the, the cuts are looking looking very crazy right now. I might have to go with the other one. I'm, I'm not sure. This is the big one. Is there anything you want to go over? Yeah, let's go. Let's, let's try out something real quick. Let's see what the obvious approach looks like. <laughs> mm. Mm. Um, all right. Uh, we're going through the wall, so we'll just need a skeleton crew. <laughs> okay. Um, two gunmen and two drivers. The first driver will pilot one of the choppers getting you out of there. Half the gold will be in that chopper, so these better be some safe effing hands. And the second driver's in charge of the train. I don't think we need to hire someone very expensive for this. It ain't that complicated. Come on. Okay. Uh, is it? That's the only person we get? Okay. Gunman 1 is with Franklin, burrowing in and pulling out the gold. Gunman 2 hits the bank lobby with you and makes it look like you're a couple of idiots trying your luck. Alright, so I'd rather have him inside and him outside. Alright, so basically the 15% cut of the hacker is where the problem comes in at because uh i basically got the same people i think uh except for the the other driver well he said he didn't have to be inexperienced so that was a six percent cut i think all right let me think about this real quick jesus christ he's milking it all right i made my decision i'm gonna go with the more subtle approach um first gunman then uh, the second gunman is going to be out in the lobby. First driver is going to be carrying the gold. And this driver is just going to be replacing stingers. And the hacker got to be the best page. Alright, so I'm going to go with this one right here, guys. More subtle approach. Leave your thoughts in the comment section about you know what, I'm saying, what I've done here. I don't know, man. I think this is the best way. Plus, I like the little getaway aspect, you know. Just driving a, a pallet to a train and then, you know, eh, pretty cool. Okay. But I want to be we a car chase. And the modified getaway cars. <laughs> I knew you'd like that. Sounds kind of fruity, if you ask me. Nobody asked you. Look, this is our only hope. You control traffic in this town, you control the streets. I think it could work. It will work, as long as we're ready to move now. Come on, I'll take you to the equipment. Fucking asshole. All right, let's go. All right, you guys. Uh, somebody said they fumbled a heist. I don't even know what that means. But uh, we got a whole lot of work to do. We got to get some getaway cars. And we have to get some stingers. 
I'm not sure who's going to be doing what, but whatever it takes to get this thing done. I asked for your number, but they took my phone. Hell yeah. Somebody took his phone. I wonder why. All right. Uh, I switched over to Franklin because I may need his expertise in getting the rest of these vehicles for this next mission. Now, uh, of course, you guys already know that we're doing a big score. This is going to be the biggest heist we've ever done. I do not know how much we're going to get paid, but I heard that the payout is supposed to be crazy because we we talking about gold right now. We talking about some some Federal Reserve gold. So I'm hoping that everything goes well with this heist. I'm hoping that Franklin comes out on top because it's probably going to be the character I use the most after this heist. Uh, totally not sure what the other guys are going to be doing, but I know with Franklin, I'm going to be putting in that work. So um, right now, I have to go pick up this cop car. So uh, what I'm going to do is... Uh-oh, the cops on me? Cops on me? Oh, all right. No, they, no they, just, they just passing through the lights and all that. You know how the cops do in the hood. You know what I'm saying? They just use their sirens to get past the lights. Look, look. Just spun on a red light. They ain't shit. They ain't shit. They know what they be doing. But uh, let me ride up here. I ain't supposed to be riding up here, but hey, I'm going wherever the blip takes me. So I'm gonna come right here. But let me take this helmet off. I wonder if I should keep it on as a disguise. Ah, uh, nah, forget it. Two years and Meriwether are gonna have our two. Oh no. Not gonna go that way. Can I jump? It's a good jump. Now I saw somebody. Can I sneak this out? Can I sneak it out? Ooh, am I that good? Am I that good? Yo, I just turned off the lights, and the cop didn't see me. So I think I'm good mugger, yo. Yo, that's crazy, yo. Just to think, the headlights itself is what saved my behind. Oh, whew. I feel real good about myself right now. I'm going to just say that right here, right now. All right. Oh, let me park him up. All right, where are we going with it? Where are we going? Are right, we gonna park it under here? All right, cool beans. Ew. Okay, you want me to save over top of this? That's cool. I'll do that. Ew, escapee, a minute, 17 seconds, not a scratch. All right, I got a goal completion on that one. That's cool. All right, so next order of business, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah, I'm going to be using Franklin this whole time. I have to go find these cars. Alright, let's see. Alright, you guys. I think I found out where the first car is. Uh, Oh, hold on. What's this? Is it levels to this shit? Alright, where do I go? <laughs> Alright. I'm trying to get to the next level. I got to go all the way to the top because when I seen the car in the picture... It said that it was at the top of a parking garage, so I'm just going to go ahead and uh, spin this bad boy. 
I'm saying use my special real quick on them. Oh, I guess my special don't work that well. It's cool. This ain't my car. I ain't tripping. It's levels to this shit. It's levels to this shit. I guess it is levels. How many levels do I gotta drive up to get this goddamn car? Come on, man. All right, five levels. That's cool. All right, so where's the car? All right, handicap sign. Is this it? This has to be one of them. Yep. All right, now I gotta take this joint to Los Santos Customs, which is a mile and a half away. And I guess there's no easy way out of here. Unless I wanna jump off of this. Yeah, why not? I'm going I'm going to get the car fixed up anyway, right? All day, baby. All day, baby. Watch me work. Watch me work. You better ask about me in the hood. Oh shit, no. They told me the stunt jump was failed. That's bull crap, man. That was a perfect stunt jump right there. What do you guys think? But uh, I'm on my way to take this joint to Los uh, Santos Customs. I'll see y'all when I start looking for the next vehicle. First at the UD gauntlet is modded in the lockup. Thanks for letting me know. All right, you guys, it's time for me to switch to another person to look for another gauntlet. Uh, the reason being is because it costs some bread to get these joints done, and Franklin just isn't balling like that. So uh, we're going to see what uh, other people's money looking like. I think I might get uh, two with Michael and one with Trevor. So uh, let me just take a look real quick. And look at this dude just sitting pretty in his crib. So that's just disrespectful. Okay. You alright, bro? Okay, cool. Alright, let's see what type of money he rolling with. Look at that, 248000 Yeah, we about to get this. So, uh, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to call me a cab, create me a waypoint, and then get there. Uh, look like somebody uh, getting that 25000 box or something like that for the treasure. I don't know. We'll see. But, uh, contacts. Downtown cab. Yeah, I need a cab as soon as you can. Stay where you are. I got a driver right around the corner. Thanks. Well, it should be around here somewhere, right? Alright, the jewelry store that we knocked off is around here. Right there. So... Gauntlet. Okay, found it. Dang, I drove right past the drone. It's crazy. I'm DJ. Okay, now, this mother. Nice it's not my fault. But uh, now I'm on my way to a a a a Rangers. All right, I'm on my way to uh Los Santos Customs joint with this and uh. I'll be back when it's time for the look for the next one. Be right back, y'all. Second gauntlet to go, Lest. Good. We only need one more. All right, you guys. It's time for me to look for the last one. So uh, let's check and find out where it's at. Now, uh, I'm going to do this mission with Michael, seeing as though it's only right. All right, Mission Row, Templar Hotel, southeast of Legion Square. Okay, so I'm going to look for something on my mini-map with all of this red stuff going on and look two blocks over. So let's see what we got. Okay, I see that this is it right here. What's this? Oh, vehicle impound, huh? So uh, let me just make a waypoint for right here. 
And I need to still a car. Matter of fact, you know what? This time I'm going to call me a cab service. I know that's probably too far out. Alright, so I'm facing this way, which means I need to go the other way. And around. Let me put my phone away. Alright, this really shouldn't be hard to do. Here we go, right here. This is that bad boy. Alright. See, now that wasn't too hard. Alright, so... Got about a mile and some change. This really worked out pretty good for me. I ain't gonna lie. I thought finding these cars were gonna be so much harder. But uh, I guess, you know, traveling around this whole entire map all the time and really knowing Rockford Hills and, you know, most of the Los Santos areas, pretty cool. But I just can't wait to do this heist, man. I'm, I'm so jittery. Like, have you ever felt like you're so nervous that you might keep failing the mission or you know you might do something wrong and you want to start over like that's how i'm feeling right now like i'm feeling like i'm just going to completely botch this entire mission from the start and probably gonna to have to do it 10 times street i don't know man like sometimes i just get i just get i don't know a little bit of like stage fright i guess you could say and it's funny because i'm playing by myself like this, this is old day like i don't want to i don't want to mess up i want to make sure everything goes perfectly so uh oh snap almost then going the right area so uh i think i'll get a medal for this joint with the not a scratch joint because um i don't think i hit nothing so i might get a gold medal on this joint all right heist prep extras that's all we need All right, so we got the cars. About to take this last one to lock up. And then the heist should be right around the corner because I already got the stingers. And, you know, the next video is going to be crazy. Like, I don't know I don't know what I'm going to do in that video, but, you know, I'm probably going to have to throw a little pub out there for my channel. You know what I'm saying? Be like, subscribe, <laughs> like the video, stuff like that, you know. Saying sometimes you gotta be technical with your fans, man. Alright, can I go inside this one? Yes, I can. Alright. You should be good to go. Need a car. I'm gonna hawk this drone down. Oh, I'm about to cut him off. No, I'm not. Alright, I got a gold for that drink. And I got 20 grand. Am I supposed to make a call? Yeah. Third and final gauntlets, primed and ready. Excellent. I'll let the others know we have everything we need. And we'll meet at the strip club. Alright, you guys. I'm on my way to the strip club. Yeah. Throw a couple ones before we get into this heist. This is IKC signing out. And I'm going to see y'all in the next video. Peace. This is Siri. Thank you for watching and be sure to like this video. For more videos from this particular mode, click more videos. If you want to see more content from IKC, click subscribe. Oh, and don't forget to follow IKC on Twitter and to like his Facebook page. This is Siri signing out. Peace.